The whole team, you know, just run out and have a good start. Ball movement was good. It seemed like your teammates were making an effort to get the ball in your hands. Did it feel that way? Uh, yeah, you know, some, uh, some we're in some plays, and then, yeah, the game went on. Continued to find me, and I was being aggressive. Overall, how is your confidence growing over these three games now that you're back? Oh, it's getting better and better every game. Were, were you expecting Tibbs to pull you out after the fourth foul? The fourth one? Yeah, 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 I knew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The fourth one, yeah. Yeah, but you, you were able to, you finished the game before, right? So yeah, like, yeah. Did you have to change? The yeah, yeah. Game? Just stay out of the way. <laughs> Don't foul. <laughs> It looked like you were a little bit more aggressive offensively. Is that a fair? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. what, what led to that? Oh, just watching film, uh, realizing where I could have been more aggressive, where I could find shots, where I could look for my shot. Can you describe the two-man game you had going, not only with Jalen, but with Isaiah, working your cuts to the basket? Oh, just, uh, you know, they're great passers, so whenever uh, I see them driving or whenever I, I see them driving or coming off a screen, I just try to gain their vision, either cut or spot up, and they usually find me. How difficult was it, especially with those four fouls, to guard DeRozan in that second half? Oh, yeah, um, always hard guarding DeMar. He's a very crafty, very good player, uh, amazing player. So it's always hard, but especially with four fouls. So you just got to keep your hands back and just stay down. Were you as surprised as the rest of us to see them kind of throw the, the alley-oop off the backboard? And yeah, no, I don't think anyone knew what was going on.